Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. This is the makeup look that I'm doing today. It's springtime so I decided to just throw on all the colors that I could and this came out and I really enjoyed doing this makeup look. It's very, very flattering. Yes, it is a lot of colors but honestly, it's just so perfect for the springtime. So if you're interested in how to get this makeup look, then just keep on watching. So as usual, I'm going to be priming my eyelid first using the MAC Pink Pot and Painterly and then setting that with a translucent powder. Alrighty, so the first color that I'm going to be placing is the color Analog from the Mi Vida Loca palette from Kat Von D. And I'm applying this with a fluffy blending brush into my crease area and really diffusing this color because I want a wash of it since this is my transition shade. And if you want, you can totally build this as needed. You don't have to go right away with a whole bunch of color because that will make it very difficult to blend later. I'm taking Destroyer now and I'm going to be placing this slightly beneath the analog and I kind of wanted it to look like a sunset so I put it slightly beneath and if you notice I always pack it on with a dense brush and then I use the blending brush to blend the colors together because it's so much easier than just trying to blend it in with a smaller bl 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 brush. Picking up Anthem now, I'm placing this right on my outer third just because it was looking a little bit too orangey and I wanted to incorporate some purple to the look and I love this effect. Honestly, it's beautiful. Next, I'm going to be taking any kind of uh, beige color and I'm going to be packing this right on the lid. I wanted the lid to be very light because of all that was going on in the outer third of the eye. So just any beige cream color will do on the lid. You can even do sparkle if you want. So I really just don't want to repeat myself because I'm just getting repetitive and annoying at this point. So I will just let you see how I do my wing and leave it at that. Okay, so with the jumbo eye pencil in, I don't know what this is called. Peacock. It's called Peacock. I'm going to place this and very roughly on my lower lash line because we're going to be using a purple color to buff it in. So the color is Echo from the same palette and I'm buffing it into the blue just so it gives a really gradient effect of blues and purple. And then I'm going to use the blending brush to make it extremely smoky on the lower lash line. Alright, coming up is probably the most beautiful pigment in the whole world, so brace yourselves. It's the Inglot Pigment in 59 and it has this beautiful iridescent purples and blues. It just, just look what it's doing to my inner corner, guys. Very quickly putting mascara on my lashes and then applying blue mascara on my lower lashes because I thought it would look cool. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. Who knows? And then my trusty Grand Glamour lashes from Ilore. I got these at Target. They're so freaking beautiful and they're completely molded to my eyes, so that's why I picked them. I'm uh, just popping them on and moving on to the face. So I'm starting with the Milk Chocolate Bronzer from Too Faced and I'm applying that because why not? And then making a really disgusting face and following with Deep Throat Blush from NARS and applying this to the apples of my cheeks. And then with Champagne Pop from Becca and I just want to say that after I got yeah, done using this, it fell on the floor into a million pieces. So let's just like not talk about this anymore because I just want to cry. Thinking happy thoughts, I'm just placing this on the cheekbones, uh, you know, above my eyebrows. I really love it there. I love to look really dewy, so that's just me. And five seconds before I started filming this video, I got my dose of colored liquid lipsticks in the mail. So you already know I had to just put all of them on. So I'm going to be using truffle all over my lips and then going in with stone right in the middle and it, they're just so freaking beautiful you can just see my lips are horrible but the lipsticks are beautiful so that is the finished look everybody i know i was quite all over the place today but you know i lost my champagne pop and i got my dose of colors in the mail so it, i was just all over the place you know that's just one of those days Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and please subscribe to my channel and like this video if you liked it and leave comments down below on looks that you would like me to recreate and I will get back to you and we'll chat about it. And don't forget to look at all my other videos that I posted and let me know what you think and I will see you next week. Bye guys!